the first attempt from continental Europe to launch an orbital rocket failed. Oh no. Now, it did manage to take off, but then it quickly nosedived back to Earth 30 seconds later into the sea with quite an extraordinary explosion. Okay, so it crashed. Doesn't sound like a roaring success. But it was described as a test launch, right? Like, was it ever expected to get all the way into orbiting the Earth? Yeah, well, the private company who organized this launch, uh, they're called Isar Aerospace, they really don't see this launch as a failure. At least they are framing it in that way in their statements. Daniel Metzler, the CEO and co-founder of the company, said in a press release, our first test flight met all our expectations and was a great success. We had a clean takeoff, 30 seconds of flight, and we were also able to validate our flight termination system. I believe it's not merely post-crash spin. Also because he said things before the launch, suggesting that he didn't expect the launch to get all the way into orbit. Metzler Mm -hmm. was actually quoted as saying uh, last week, frankly, I'd be happy if we just fly 30 seconds. And they did that. So, um, yeah, maybe it's not such a bad week.